Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Jessica and I make beauty and lifestyle videos. For today's video, I'm gonna be doing an empties video of all the products that I've been loving lately and running out of that I need to repurchase still. I need to go do that. But before we get started, I'm gonna put my Instagram name here if you wanna go follow me there, and I'm gonna put my Snapchat name here if you wanna go follow me there. I also recently did a mini series on the Whole30 and our experience with that, and I'll put that in the cards here so you can go take a look if you're interested. And without further ado, let's get started. The first product I have today is my sunscreen from Trader Joe's. It's SPF 30 and water resistant and I went through this very quickly. I think it's really important to wear sunscreen all over your body, all day, especially in the summer, and I really enjoyed this. It has a, um, well, it's fragrance-free, but it has a nice smell, so I really like the sunscreen from Trader Joe's. Next up, I have my CeraVe Moisturizing Cream. This is something that I would put on my face as soon as I got out of the shower. It's very hydrating. And it says it moisturizes, restores, maintains protective skin barrier, and all that good stuff. So I really recommend this. I got mine at Costco, so it's a nice giant container. Next up, I have my Neutrogena Cleanser and Mask. You can use this as a daily cleanser or an occasional mask. And it is very deep cleaning. You can use it as a daily cleanser to clear breakouts and blackhead causing impurities, or use as an intensive mask for deep cleansing and extra oil control. Moving on to hair products, I really like the Tresemme Heat Tamer for a drugstore heat protectant for my hair, and I go through these quite constantly. Especially with long hair, it's easy to use up hair products quickly. Another drugstore favorite, the Batiste Dry Shampoo. I like the tropical, I like the regular, there's a blush one. I go through these constantly and I go through them so much that my local store sends me coupons for just these because they track what you buy the most of and then send you coupons for those. So I get a lot of coupons for this one. And for my one product that's not drugstore, this is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day 5-in-1 Styling Treatment. And it is awesome when you're styling bangs like mine. You definitely need product and you definitely need a lot of it. So this one's a great one. I didn't go through it too fast, so I think this size is a good size, but for me, because I do style my hair every day or so, I definitely use up more than this than I think the average person does. Not a hair expert, and I probably do it wrong. Moving on to beauty and makeup related products. First, I have the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner. Here's one empty box, and another, and another and I haven't been collecting these empties that long, so that goes to show, one, how much I use eyeliner because this product does last a while, and two, how much I like this eyeliner. I think it's a great eyeliner for beginners who are learning to do a little wing or wanting to get more creative, but want something that's easy to use. It's very easy to draw on your lines and color it in. It's not too black, so if you want something very black, you definitely would want to go over it a little bit with another product. I think it's a really great eyeliner for beginners and it stays on all day and I like that a lot. I can even wear it when I work out and it'll stay on longer than the other ones that I try. I don't wear makeup most of the times I work out, but when I do, I'll grab this. Another product I like to use if I'm gonna throw on a little something before I work out is the L'Oreal Waterproof Mascara and it's the Voluminous Hydrofuge and I think it's in black. It doesn't make your lashes super full or anything, but it just throws on a little color. Maybe you're going out and working out with a bunch of people and you just want to have a little something so you look more awake or whatnot. But I highly recommend this one if you're gonna wear a little bit of something when you work out. Another favorite I have that is now empty is the e.l.f. primer. It is poreless face primer. It smells a little funky. It doesn't have any fragrance really to it. I think it's just what's in it. But I think this is a great pore diminishing minimizer primer for an affordable price at the drugstore. So I really like this product. And then my final product is an eye makeup remover and it's by The Body Shop. It's the Chamomile Gentle Eye Makeup Remover for all skin types. It also has community fair trade chamomile that they use and I really like that. They're against animal testing and I really like that. So it's definitely a product that I support in those ways. 
and this product it removes your eye makeup very easily. It doesn't leave your eyes feeling super greasy and it's very gentle on your eyes. So if I got it in my eyes, it never stung and I just really like this product. Those were all my recent empties. I hope you liked this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Again, if you want to follow me on Instagram, it'll be right here. And if you want to follow me on Snapchat, I'll put it right here. And then I'm also going to put some videos in the cards here that you can take a look at the other ones that I've uploaded. And I hope that you enjoyed this and enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!